Let me go ahead and open up my stock that I've made. There we go. I'm going to go ahead and put that on in there. And let's get to whisking. I'm kind of wishing I'd have put it in another pot. But this is all kind of winging it because I wasn't planning on making this. I was planning on just browning my sausage. But then this just took off. Well, you were here. You saw what happened. Not to worry, these lumps will leave. One cool thing I can do, like with these lumps, I can <laughs> I can put inside my Vitamix and just get rid of the lumps. So I won't have to do all this whisking. Put this in. I think that's enough gravy. And what I'm going to do is I have my vitamins machine here. I'm going to pour it on in here so I don't have to keep doing all that whisking. I'm going to pour it on in here and just blend it up. And it'll get rid of all my lumps. So let me go ahead and pour all this in. Let's hope I don't spill. You guys cross your fingers. Let's see. Am I a professional? Oh, I am a professional. I didn't even spill any. I rock. So this would have been the easier approach. I'm going to take this on over to my Vitamix and just blend it up. Get rid of the lumps. Alright, so I have the gravy in here. Here's my Vitamix. What I'm going to do is I'm going to keep, I'm going to cut it on first. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to slowly increase it. And I'll tell you where I stop it. I'm not going to switch it to high because I don't think I need to take it on high. So let me go ahead and adjust the camera, move it on up, and you can be able to see the stock that I have. So I'm going to go ahead and cut it on. And I just moved it to variable speed two, three, four, and it's already starting to get rid of a lot of lumps. I'm going to take it to five. Yeah, I see a little bit of it, but um, it's a lot of it's pretty much gone. But I'm going to take it to six just to be safe. That looks good. That looks good. So I'm going to go ahead and cut it off. It's at variable speed six. That's what I took it up to. I'm going to take the speed down all the way to one. And I'm going to go ahead and cut it off. And that is basically done. So to be able to check it out, I'm going to go ahead and let, take this out. And I'm going to put it back in the pot. And then I'm going to put the sausage in there with it. And see if I need to make any adjustments. This is me pouring it in. <gasps> no lumps. Wasn't that easy? I don't know what I was thinking doing all that whisking. I didn't even have to do that. But if you don't have the Vitamix, go ahead and whisk away. We what? We work it out. So that's done there. And now what I'm going to do is just kind of break up the sausage. I don't want it to be too small, but I'm going to break it up some. 